Good morning everybody. It's not even 10 a.m. yet and I am awake playing Doom with my health potion. Uh, but because of, well, I have a little something to say to our American friends. And they are our friends. Especially the ones who are. Um, I have always maintained, and still do, that I am entirely apolitical. I am. I do not believe in the theatrics of politics. I think it is a stage act. I think there are scripts involved, and I think there are agendas involved that our elected officials have been given the role of putting forward by higher powers. Yet, uh, oh, and I have not voted for in 30 years in Finland for anybody. In Finland it's a joke anyway because we have no real alternatives or options. We have just the same homogeneity across the board of independence and like how many over 10 parties so it's a joke yet in spite of this if I were an American I would vote in the upcoming presidential election because I think it could change the direction of the whole world I think Europe would have to take stock if America got a true alternative. Somebody who represents very different interests at least than the corporate candidates of the duopoly. And I have been watching this man's interviews and speeches and I have only one reservation about him, that he is Catholic and uh, seems to be a devout one. Yet, he never brings up religious arguments like some other candidates. And I'm actually talking about this because he was not let in the full debate of the two major clowns my opinion. If you don't agree with me that they're clowns, that's fine. I have nothing against you because of that. Um, so I'm gonna give you a name and I hope that if you, if you are an American and you're going to vote, you will at least look into him. I'm not telling you to change your vote or see things my way, but I'm just saying that you should know about him and his views before you choose who you vote for. Robert Fitzgerald Kennedy Jr. I would vote for him. And with that, we start map 07 plain sailing. <laughs> Just a moment. Olga? The cat wants something, I thought she was going to see.
I guess it's just restless because it's raining. It's a nice, lovely summer rain. Uh, and warm, but still raining. Of course, if it should happen that Kennedy gets the democratic candidacy then of course at some point everyone I forgot this that this is gonna be this one there's probably oh god better way of doing this I'm ducking with my actual head too. before I die. I'm a bit worried about what's coming with the arachnathron. Okay, so it's not just this easy. God, I'm an idiot. Okay, let's collect stuff and see what we have to do. Maybe the cat wants to be with me and wants to be on a chair next to me. While she decides I'll have some health potion. Thirty years, by the way, is a little bit of an exaggeration. It's not quite been thirty years since I voted something like twenty-five, rather. Last time I voted was because my dad asked me to, and uh, uh, actually uh, bribed me with a bottle of wine.
not doing well, but at least I'm still alive. Just a moment. I'm sorry about this. Olga? Hmm. She's, I think, frustrated that she can't go on. Restless. Okay. Um, let's go somewhere. I do hope that the what doesn't get to too slaughtery. I'm not comfortable playing slaughter. That is to say that in these have been fine. These are nice, but if there's gonna if it's gonna get more severe, then I'm not. I don't play slaughter. Let's put it that way. I can play watch which have some slaughter scenes, but not watch that devolve into slaughter. So I hope this doesn't, because I really like this so far. to do up there. Or... Ah. I didn't see. Takes a little time. Let's also check what's there after we have some health potion which has helped me lose 4.5 kilos in less than two months. Yes, this morning for the first time I weighed only 64 kilos. something stupid. Oh my god. Oh 
worker. Okay, now it looks like she's coming this way. Oh! gonna change backwards but I didn't. Save? Nope. Go. Oh. Okay. See? This is the problem. What? Okay. Jesus. Probably I'll get something useful from there. No? Huh. Hmm. Looks like a secret. It was down there. Okay, yeah, getting away. Oh! This might open it. Make a spear? No.
Oh god, of course. Of course. I was hoping not. <laughs> This is good though, because this is probably a hundred inch And that means that We're making real progress Oh, only 102 left This was... Yeah, okay How many secrets? I've got one out of three, not great uh, It's hard to say if I should... Just doesn't make any difference if I take it. Okay. I do think so far this is slaughter done right. Uh, I'm not sure what to do. Certainly not jump there. I'll jump from the other side. Maybe they kill each other a bit too before that. Three, three, four. Well, I could have jumped from there too. Okay. Woo! That's it! Wow! This is not probably even half an hour. 400. This was nice. I wouldn't play 10 maps like this in a row, but this is nice. As it is. As a change, as a... There. And the music is very nice because it gives a sense of urgency. You know. Can I open that secret? Uh, oh, it could, it could be this switch too. You know, though it's a bit far. Right. It's not that. One of these could have a switch or something. No, don't see anything. I'll go. I don't actually need to worry much because there's no enemies left. Oh, there. I'm gonna go there. Which, which, it's that one, okay. Wait, yeah, I do have to. 
do this. And it's the one on the other side of the perimeter. different this is different the others are closed there we go. <laughs> That's a secret. <laughs> Two out of three. Oh, I just checked that it didn't open this one. No, of course not. So if I found a platform that somehow was different, Maybe. No. I don't think I can get a top that. No. Let's go. Alright. Slaughter done right. 